you very much, Teresa, and um, good evening to all of you. Every year, I really look forward to this awards evening. For me, it's an absolute privilege to be here as we take time to share the stories of our most committed and talented students. The students we recognize publicly tonight are a source of both inspiration and pride for me as a governor, and I expect a lot of you also in the audience. I'm sure as you hear about the individual journeys to success, you will feel exactly the same. This evening is about recognizing and celebrating their outstanding and astounding achievements. And it's also a little chance to look back over the last year in the life of the college as a whole and to consider what we have achieved together. We are, I'm proud to say, London's leading college. The quality of the teaching and learning we offer, the commitment and abilities of our staff, and the passion, energy, and talent of our students remain a winning combination. And our results speak for themselves. In 2012, we achieved the best A-level results in our history, with an overall pass rate of 99.1%. And 73% of students achieved A-star to C grades, which means more have been accepted into higher education courses, and many of them at prestigious Russell Group universities. As a college, we continue to develop the range and quality of courses we offer. In doing so, we aim to provide every single student with the skills they need to be successful. In 2012, we have developed new higher apprenticeship qualifications and new partnerships to tackle worklessness. We have grown our higher education provision and created an innovative job search service at the Center for Lifelong Learning. We are not a college that believes in standing still. And as you know, our college is much more than an academic institution. Every year, students and staff come together to take part in an astonishing range of activities that go beyond the curriculum, from charity events and community projects to public performances and exhibitions, these activities are a fundamental and enriching part of life at the college. A copy of our annual review was on your seats as you arrived, so I hope you will please take time to read about the many, many things we have had cause to celebrate in 2012. This time last year, I stood here and spoke a little about my 20th, yes, my 20th year as a governor. Well, in 2013, we will be reflecting on and also celebrating the college's 20th birthday. City and Islington College was created through a merger of four separate institutions in 1993. The merger created the largest college in London and with it, an opportunity to transform post-16 education locally. Tom Jupp, the principal at the time, who I'm delighted to say is here in the audience somewhere, Tom, wherever you are, has been speaking to students recently and staff, both past and present, about the college's developments over those years in preparation for the 20th anniversary book that we are producing. Their stories are many and varied, of course, but every single one says something very powerful about the kind of college we are all part of. They talk about striving to achieve and to be successful, no matter what the barriers and obstacles. And they talk with passion about the importance of being part of something that is bigger than themselves. I personally believe that creating a true and meaningful sense of community is integral to the college's success. 
Across the wider community, I believe there is great potential to also create relationships that enable people to change lives for the better. And I'd like to tell you a little bit more about that. Islington is home to some of the country's richest people, but we also have the fourth highest level of child poverty in England and the lowest life expectancy for men in London. Islington Giving is a campaign for local philanthropy which asks residents, businesses and local charities to give what they can, be it money or time, to make a real difference to this community. It endeavours to use the huge diversity we have in Islington for the benefit of those who need it the most. There are currently 30 projects supported by Islington Giving which are investing in young people, tackling poverty, and confronting social isolation. And many of them rely on volunteers. People all over Islington are getting involved. And I know here within the college they are getting involved too. And if this is Islington giving is you to anybody here in this audience, I would urge you please to also get involved in any way you can, either in giving time or in giving money. But the sort of work we are doing is knocking on estates, knocking on the doors on estates to help those who are isolated to find employment, ensuring older people who are vulnerable have much needed social interaction and are being trained as mentors in some cases to build the confidence and skills of local parents, leading them to go on and get jobs. As chairman of the Islington Giving Appeal and as a governor of this college, I am struck by the extraordinary things that can happen when groups of people with the same values and purpose come together to create change. College students, members of staff, local residents and businesses, together we truly do add up to more than the sum of our parts. And now I have great pleasure in introducing our guest speaker for this evening, Javed Khan. Javed is currently Chief Executive of Victim Support, a national charity which responds to the needs of victims and witnesses of crime. He has 28 years of experience in the United Kingdom public and voluntary sectors with senior leadership roles in local government and as a teacher and then assistant principal at a further education college in Birmingham. He has led initiatives that widen participation, raise achievement, and reduce social exclusion, and has worked extensively with the voluntary community, voluntary and the community sector, and local business, developing sustainable strategic partnerships that tackle urban deprivation. We are very lucky to hear it, have him here this evening, and I can think of nobody better to address us. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Javid Khan. Chairman and, uh, and ladies and gentlemen, students, teachers, governors, business partners, Mr. Mayor, uh, delighted to uh, be here 